so what's up guys how are you doing good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you could be watching <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> all right guys i'm here uh moving around bones guys i am about to surprise you guys with a huge huge <laughs> something something so i'm um, just moving here right here yeah so i'm in uh, chambogo if you know the place i am trying to to see if i can find i am at was city moto limited motors limited right here guys so i am in shopping 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 uh, a vehicle So guys, I am here in the <laughs> mid down. The traffic is crazy, crazy. As you can see. The jam right here is crazy, guys. Uh, today I am in Midtown still on an assignment uh, so i grabbed a border border but the jam is crazy here guys for uh, uh, <laughs> a car so I'm going to some some uh, ones around the, around the city center uh, the bonded warehouses for cars that's what I mean uh, to see around and see if I can find something but um, yeah wait for the surprise you will have to continue to watch the video full length so that you know what this video is about yeah so guys the assignment is still on here where i'm standing you can see those are uh, cars for sale uh let me move right now i am in the city center guys uh, <laughs> i was given an assignment to look for a car guys for buying and uh, continue watching to know how the story will end guys so i am here around the uh, nakasero road around uh, rumumba avenue guys so uh, i'm just taking you around showing you uh, right now i'm in second i'm going to look for second hand or used cars to see to compare the prices earlier if you have watched from the start i started from uh, from <laughs> this work is, uh, is complicated guys i started from uh, where they sell new cars that is around chambogo they are car bonds where you enter and you look at new cars so today i am in mid town where they sell second hand or used vehicles um so this uh, video is about telling you how to look for a car here in uganda uh if from scratch or from zero if you are a new driver uh if you want a car what to do yeah so that is what i'm doing i'm just moving along this street um because that is where second hand cars are uh so yes you have to if you are a beginner my advice would be to begin with uh, uh, second hand cars and the price uh, i'll also share the prices uh, because when you are a beginner you will have to <laughs> scratch your car here and there like when you're getting out of your gate or when you're parking near others usually they are those uh, minor minor scratches that you do so if you have bought your dream car and 
you are still a learner definitely when you scratch there is that pain you feel like even the cost to repair it uh, is higher so to me I would encourage you to first buy a second hand a second hand car or a used car and here used cars can begin from uh, about let me see 10 million 10 million is about uh, three thousand uh, dollars or less or more I don't know the rate now but yeah about three thousand or less you can get a used car uh, which you can uh, start with then when you master the roads then you can think of upgrading to your dream car guys that is my idea really so I am moving around here I'm going to show you where other markets are but really in uh, in Uganda that is the minimum of where you can think of buying a car if you have 10 million or less uh, you can get a basic car which can make you familiar with the roads uh, to have a, a few scratches and you repair then the next day you scratch it again of course you still feel the pain but at least it is not as when you're driving your dream car so yes let me turn the camera because i've reached where there are other another market for cars second hand cars then i'll tell you more stories so right here also it is uh, nakasero you see these are cars for sale these are uh, used cars or second hand cars like they come to the bond people buy them then after they resell to be sold again so right here uh, we have such markets here in midtown uh, let me tell you because i have uh, some ideas around here concerning cars uh, there is another place ahead where i'm going it is uh, <laughs> famous and uh, it is known as uh, pine because I think at one time there used to be uh, pine trees but now I think palm trees so they call it pine here but um, I think it is I don't know whether those pines are still there but that place is called pine that place is famous or oh, it is known for uh, second hand second hand uh, cars selling place or market but there are other places like here where I'm from uh, around Nakasero around the uh, if you know phase two around there 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 is uh, a place for cars second-hand cars that is around pine uh, you can slope at Simba Manyo around there if you're Ugandan you know where those buildings are um, where else yeah if you want other used cars they are found in uh, in uh, which place is that in Bakuli there are also some uh, selling points uh, also, if you know Chibuye, that side as you go to Maki India, there are also a few places where you can buy second-hand cars. So yeah, those are central, central places where you can buy used cars. But if you want uh, new cars, you have to go to the bonds. And most bonds are located on uh, Ginger Road Highway as you go from as you go towards uh, the border of Kenya, as you exit Kampala city, that is Ginger Road. That's where you can find uh, bonded warehouses for cars. And I was there earlier. So if you are just joining at this point, you can start from the beginning so that you see the bonds where, uh, where I started this video from. But still those bonds uh, bring in like reconditioned cars. They are usually not as new, new. But you also know that if you want new cars, you can go to Toyota Uganda, you can go to Nissan, 
you can go to to Benz yeah those brands uh, and you can also as well order from Japan direct and they bring you zero kilometers cars yeah uh, that is uh, the new west uh, the new kind of cars which they bring on those what cars are those like they are loaders but they they have trolleys on top where they bring your car with zero kilometers guys there is also that option yeah so if you know sir apollo kagwa primary school nakasero that's where i am right now and still moving towards phase two around phase two is what i was telling you that um they, there is a market for second-hand cars or, uh, or used cars uh, which people buy then resell later for others also to see if they can reuse them so yeah that's where I'm going so right now I'm at first two that is a restaurant a restaurant a good restaurant here uh, in Nakasero so this is the place you see all those cars are for sale this is where i'm going to enter yeah and if you know insurance tower this building around this there is where you can find uh used second hand cars or third hand cars yeah so i'm going to compare prices with what we are looking for here all these cars are for sale let me enter there uh, and I show you what I mean any kind of car is found here right here so you see we have Range Rovers we have Benzes uh, we have uh, Lexus I'm seeing Volvo here for sale and here is uh, what is this V8 or something and the Benz is right here here is Golf guys Audi any car is found here you can come and support them here is the Benz right here what is this this is Alphard hey, Toyota Alphard is here guys beautiful beautiful vehicles here here is another golf i think guys look at this let me turn the camera and i show you so you see this is where i am at guys looking looking around for the best that i can uh, we compare prices and see what we will settle for guys the assignment is still going on just know it is a tough tough assignment <laughs> guys I am seeing beautiful cars here uh, so any car of your budget can be found here look at this guys all this I was showing you this building from a distance this is insurance tower if you know where it is located around pine you can come and get any car of your choice of any budget starting from three thousand dollars you can afford a car here in uganda up to infinity i have shown you the golfs i have shown you the bands i have shown you range rovers any car you can buy depending on what you have starting from um like three thousand dollars or ten million you can drive a car or even less for starters yeah so when you're here you must be careful you must come with a mechanic to help you unless you are my type <laughs> you might not afford this life so you have to wait and drive the one which comes on a, on a, on that load that is it a trailer guys tell me the name of those long vehicles which carry cars from Mombasa port coming to Uganda so that the car comes direct to the customer at zero mileage so yeah this is where I am right now 
window shopping vehicles here. You can see all types are here. I am seeing Mr. Bushi here, right here. Behind me, that is a Mr. Bushi. Uh, I am seeing foresters here. Everything, guys, is, is here. <laughs> guys are looking at me and wondering what this woman is doing early morning. I am at Pine. Around there, there is Cavelli, Cavelli, Bakery, and more. If you know that restaurant, that's where I'm standing. So all these streets has second-hand cars. Yeah, if you want any car, you come to this place. But there are other places, as I have mentioned earlier, that you can go and try. And I know some markets in uh, in uh, Maki, India. As you leave the roundabout, there are also some points where you can buy cars. There is another place in um, Bakuli. Around there, you can also find some cars around Old Kampala. If you are of this place and you are familiar with the city center, you should be knowing these places that I'm mentioning. Uh, but for new ones, you have to go to the ponds or the ones which are refurbished, which you're going to get the latest number plate. Those ones you go to Chambogo. This is Cafeli. It is a bakery and more. It is a restaurant around here. You know this place. And of course, I'm walking towards... Uh, I think here is an embassy, a Danish embassy or something. I don't remember which, what it is. But this one is Simbamanyo building. I, it hosts a ministry, uh, a government ministry. I think it is gender and labor. Yeah, I'm seeing words there, gender and labor house. So there is a ministry which sits there. And besides it is the high court of Uganda. The judiciary, I think that is where they sit. So yeah, guys, yeah, this is the embassy I was telling you, the Royal Danish Embassy. I'm just moving around and they don't allow cameras, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, we just get going because I am just a passerby, so harmless. <laughs> I have nothing to, to do with them. Here where I'm walking towards is the uh, Gwenzoidi courts. I think there are also offices. Uh, Gwenzoidi house and Gwenzoidi courts around there is where I'm walking. I'm done with the assignment. I know now the range of the car we are looking for. I'm going to tell the responsible people. I'm going to update them with my findings. Then we make a decision with zero on one that we are going to buy, guys. Keep watching to know the full story of what is happening in this video. The surprise is yet to happen, guys. So keep watching, give the likes to this video, comment in the comment section below. Oh, guys, the sun is out. Yeah, comment in the comment section below here. And um, my bag is open. These guys might touch it <laughs> might pick anything anytime let me have it closed yeah so I was closing my bag but um, yeah we are going to do this keep watching guys comment in the comment section below here of what content you could be wanting to have and uh, I'll definitely see you on my next one, guys. Bye for now. So, guys, right now I am at above Grand Imperial Hotel. I see Golden Tripod Casino around there. Just in this roundabout. Going to Nakasero, going to Sheraton, going to <laughs> that, that roundabout. That's where I am trying to cross, guys. You have to run. So Nakasero Road is right there. Te, Tenan Avenue right there. As if going to Sheraton Hotel. 
this fence is for Sheraton guys that's where I am just moving guys subscribe because man this level of bravery is for the world guys I'm just crossing the road <laughs> so guys I'm just chatting away with you as I walk looking for a next border to take me back to office it is still early in the morning I had to do this early early in the morning so that I give update and we make a decision guys because later in the day <laughs> we should be having this vehicle and handing it over yeah keep watching for the surprise um, my hand is tired oh, i didn't carry my selfie stick so i'm here sweating so guys where i have reached right now is that this renowned monument this one this one here ah tricky situation guys boys who are passing me are not clear so yeah here is the independence monument around here if you're Ugandan you know where this is located around Stadler Chattered and uh, this roundabout here and Grand Imperial so I'm just uh, between there that's where you find that independence monument this is where I am standing, that is the Independence Monument. Yeah, just moving around guys, enjoying the, the breeze, it is windy. As you can see, my sweater is falling, let me remove it actually. So guys, I was removing my sweater, because now I've walked and sweated. Yeah, let me just put it here and we move on so guys i am just walking around the streets of kampala i am done with what i was supposed to do now i'm waiting for people who trusted me with this assignment to call me and we meet and I tell them the update of my findings then we do the surprise uh, so right here where i'm i'm moving is nile avenue around here this fence is for sheraton hotel let me see if i can show you yeah that building here is sheraton hotel uh, and here and if you're new here guys i am christine come see me to jump uh, some people call me CK. others call me CKT. Others call me Tina, others Krishi, others they come see me. So whichever is easier for you, yeah, I'm cool that way. And uh, you can subscribe to my channel. I see Trika guys behind me, so I have to hold strongly. Is these guys just passed me? I had to pause the video <laughs> so that I first see if it is <laughs> if I am safe or not. So before I was interrupted by men, you have to be careful on who is around you guys. As you do these videos, it is not easy, especially around town. Like in the village, it is okay because you know everyone. There is no one interested even in your phone. <laughs> but here in the city, as you do videos, you have to keep looking around like this, like this, to see if there could be any tricky situation around you so when those guys passed i was like eh. <laughs> so guys yeah i was still telling you that you can subscribe to my channel uh, like the videos support me the best way you know how by commenting uh, by liking the video by subscribing guys subscribe to my channel if you haven't especially the new people and of course, I always appreciate and thank people who return 
the returning subscribers who are always with me in this especially who those who have those who started this journey with me and they have stuck around with me all through I can never thank you enough so guys right now I am at Mosakot right here yeah Mosakot is just above uh, statistics house and I'm just sloping to which hotel is this let me reach there and tell you I'm looking for a border meanwhile so that I get go that tall building you're seeing is Crested Towers and Crested Towers is just below Serena Hotel yeah so around here is Serena guys uh, this is <laughs> this is also part of like uptown <laughs> uptown tour around here I've stopped this border let me see if he can drop me where I'm going mm, the university. Uh, uh, cool. Pepsi mm. uh, Eh, yeah, uh, sat. <laughs> Nina satu bro. So guys, Nina satu. Where is that? Eh. Simani kudinya. Can it again? Serena Hotel guys right here yeah so you got a video kache kache so guys I got a good border guy he's telling me that this place is safe so yeah he's taking me to where I'm heading as you can see traffic is so bad today that's why we always opt for border borders because they sail us through easily when things are tough here like this uh, you save time on a border border than when you use uh, other public means or you are driving your own private car uh, if you have watched my previous videos guys I told you earlier that this place around uh, Chambogo, around uh, Spear Motors, around uh, Nakawa, there are roadworks going on as you can see. So that's also what's in the state of the traffic flow. So yeah, it is crazy guys like this. So I am sloping down here, that is Chambogo. <laughs> yes, <several. laughs> some guy is saying hello. Uh, yeah, so we are sloping so guys you see it is just crazy when you hear the whistles those are police guys ordering uh, motorcycles and and cars to flow so it is crazy crazy here guys the dust is too much let me cover with my sweater guys it is bad 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 so this is real life guys in uganda <laughs> For a female or uh, for a, a woman who ha works hard to do this. As you can see guys what I'm going through <laughs> to catch videos. So like, comment, share, subscribe guys to my channel as I bring you live uh, with no filters. The way it is is how I bring it to you guys right here. So guys if you have nothing to do here you have to avoid this place until further notice guys <laughs> this is so crazy if you can bend if what you wanted to come to do this side if it can wait <laughs> you have to wait until the roadworks are done because the traffic is just bad here as you can see guys right here so to come this side is only when it is unavoidable crazy crazy here 
the sun is hot, the traffic is hot, everything is hot, guys. So. guys the roadworks are crazy here so if you have nothing to do this side or if you have another route that you can use you can opt for that right now I'm at Cafe Java's of uh, Nakawa or Chambogo branch yeah but you see everything here is crazy crazy so guys here I am again at it with a new border border guy. We are here chatting, chatting. Now you any time when I'm here, they can see my phone. <laughs> so guys, we are moving to the next pond here. You're going to see what I'm going to do there. So keep watching. That is too much, guys. So guys, this is where I had started my video when the search began. And I think what we had liked here, uh, everyone is... Uh, giving it a tick so i think maybe we are going to settle for that yeah so i'm right right here uh in case uh we make a decision uh we shall buy what the vehicle we saw here so i'm waiting for the car broker who who brought me here so guys right here are yeah, the bonds uh in case you want a car this is where you come like a refurbished new car uh, you come to Chambo Go Banda around there. That's where you can find uh, new refurbished cars in the bonds. Uh, if you want second hand, they also have here along Chambo Go or Ginger Road, Chambo Go Banda. Yeah, those places is where you can find uh, second hand and Japan also used. new. Japan used or oh. <laughs> and Uganda used. <laughs> Here is uh, come and promote yourself, bro. My name is Ali. Hey, come closer. <laughs> yeah, right tell now them. You're hey. to Ali. Yes. Here, Banda opposite roofing. Hey. Rest for models. Hey. We have a variety. Hey. Japan use, Uganda use. Hmm. We also do car butter, butter trade. Like yeah, if you have yeah, a yeah. used car, you can bring it here yeah. and return for you. Get a new one. Ah and more business to come here yeah so you have had this gentleman he's a car dealer you can find any car here in uganda at any money starting from uh, three thousand dollars that is about 10 million or less if you are a starter you can begin in a second hand car then after you upgrade going even up to the level of buying a zero mileage car these ones which they bring on trailers yeah. those cars are called what the ones which carry cars Loaders. Uh, okay, they are called uh, loaders. loaders. Guys, if you want that also, you can find it here. So yeah, I'm still uh, waiting for my sister so that we choose. So yeah, guys, uh, we picked this car. Now it is being worked on, as you see. Yeah, this is our mechanic, Iga. You can tell us where your phone. I'm found at Makerere, Hamu uh, Towers, uh, around Gaddafi Road. Uh, when you reach there, uh, you can find me there. Uh, read in. your number. You read your number, number. In case anyone wants you. Zero seven zero one mm. eight two mm. five six mm. seventy one. Do you have MTN? I have MTN yeah. also. Okay. Zero seven seven two eight two mm. five six seventy one. Okay. Okay. This is our mechanic. He does a good job, so I would recommend. But right here. This guy was fixing a camera. Uh, this young man is uh, an electrician. He's fixing a camera and a radio in it, guys. So, yeah. Gamba, Esimuyo, read us your number. 0709 88 Okay, that one. Around Chambo. Okay, he works in Chambogo. That is his number. In case you need a radio, in case you need an alarm in your car, in case you need camera, tracker, they do all those things. So that is what they are doing here. Yeah, keep watching, guys. We are about to unleash this story, guys. Yeah. So subscribe, like the video, comment in the comment section below here. 
yeah let's do this guys so guys uh, it is later in the day I don't know how many border borders I've used or how many cars I've boarded but right now I'm in a taxi here still putting things together just keep watching in a minute you're going to see the surprise we are about to do guys yeah so continue to give those likes subscribe to my channel if you haven't guys because it is tough tough guys to create content here in Kampala but yeah all we do is to just do it guys so subscribe and if you are just joining at this point of course I am Christine Kamsime Tiyambona yeah many people call me many names uh, some call me Christine, others call me Tina, others call me CK, others call me CK. Whichever is easier for you guys, just subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll definitely see you on my next one. Bye for now. So guys, I'm still here with our mechanic. <laughs> we are right now in the supermarket looking for decoration to decorate the vehicle <laughs> so that we present it. In, in style guys okay let's figure it out how we are going to do this then uh, we continue the journey let's do this guys <laughs> so guys we are here right here this is my sister's vehicle um, so everyone has uh, come the one who is in the country has come guys uh, right now we are at uh, Canary Hotel in Bukoto it is where we are going to do this surprise and this is the time guys uh, my other sister's car is here <laughs> this is hers <laughs> this is hers this is for my other sister where is it yeah that yeah. one the, the Benz is for this one Miriam and uh, this one is for another sister of mine so we are here so my lovely people we are here uh, a few days ago I told you I was pacing around uh, looking for something and I told you it was going to be a surprise for you guys and myself and everyone here um, so a few days we sat and felt like uh, why don't we buy new wheels for my mother oh yeah when you <laughs> so, love something you enjoy it with your parents <laughs> yeah so uh, we decided in in a shortest time possible guys to um, to buy uh, to buy new wheels guys to replace my mother's car has what she had has uh, served for many years now so when she when i brought her from the village if you haven't watched my village vlogs guys i'll leave some linked here but i have many many you will get tired of them guys go watch them but i came with her from the village i drove her from the village to kampala to uh, for medical checkup, but when we reached here, we are like we can't do this guys So we pulled together our small savings to get a replacement of the car. So let's go in and we surprise her guys ah, I don't like surprises, but we are going to do this So guys here we are Let's sit and tell you say hello guys say hello Hello, mommy. How are you? How was your day? Okay. The rest of you, how are you? For you, I greet you in Pruro. We are fine. <laughs> so this is our food right now. different orders so they are coming in bits but yeah let's wait and see i'll do the general picture when everyone has received their food <laughs> so guys we are all laughters but yeah uh, this is my food this is uh, chicken tikka and uh, plain rice and um, butter naan I found, I, guys, I stepped out and found everyone done, so yeah, but I had got a few. Joan had eaten hers. How was it? Tell us. It was tasty. Okay, you recommend this mm. restaurant? Yes, I do. Okay. And? You come again. I had the mixed platter that had chicken, it had beef, and um, chicken. 
Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> I get it. <laughs> and we have here our friend Gloria. Hey, so everyone, uh, we are okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, and this one is finishing mine. Now you're washing the plate. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now she's finishing hers, but I'm beginning mine. Yeah. So uh, they are going to give me time also to take uh, my meal. Then we shall catch up, guys. It was about to surprise our mom with the car. We put together our savings. Hello. Hello. Here we are. <laughs> She's here, <laughs> crying tears of joy. <laughs> 